Hi guys, it's Kim. Welcome back to my channel and I am here with an update for my deck of panning project pan. This is a project that was created by Emily and Max and it was inspired by Maddie who is a booktuber. I will leave all the information in the description box below. So let's get on with my update. So the first product I had was for the prompt Ace of Diamonds, pick your space. That was the prompt was pick your space. So I chose the Six of Hearts, which um, was a fragrance, I think. And for that, I chose this Brazilian Crush Spray by Sol de Janeiro, and you will see that it is completely empty. So yay, goal mat on that. The second card I drew was for the seven of hearts and that was a brand you only have one of and so for that I chose the Dr. Paw Paw Balm and I marked it here and it's literally right below and my goal is to use half of it so to get to there this is a really really balmy balm <laughs> it's not sticky but it's got a little bit of a it's got like a red tint to it so to use it on my lips like before bed, I don't want to get it on my pillow. So I just pretty much use it while I'm putting on my makeup um, to moisturize my lips or in between like when I'm filming. So this is going to be in here for a long time. It went from um, 25.68 to 25.38 grams. The next card I drew was for the Nine of Hearts and that is a multi-use product. So for that I chose my Nude Sticks um, lip and cheek balm in the shade Posh and here is what it looks like this is getting smaller but it's not this is gonna take me a while my goal is to finish it and it went from 6.18 to 6.13 grams um, it's slow but I really like it I'm wearing it right now it's a really good nude for me so I'm glad I'm still using it but it's gonna take a while to pan but there's the shade of it then for the card Seven of Diamonds, um, we were to choose an A to Z shade, so I chose, or product, so I chose I, um, and I chose my Amica Lip Oil, and this is done. I'm super excited. My goal is to finish it. This is a really nice lip oil. It was citrusy smelling. It wasn't sticky. It hydrated my lips, so there is a tiny little bit down at the bottom, but I can't get that out, and I am not pulling the stopper. I have too many lip products, and I'm just not all about that life, so if that disappoints you, I'm sorry, but I'm not going to do that. And then for the Six of Clubs, in it for the long haul, I sure am. Um, yes, ma'am, as Deb would say. I chose my Pixie Hydrating Milky Mist, and when I started, it was up there, and now it's down here. I've been using it a lot this winter with my Seven Skins method. I put it in between each layer and at night for my skincare, and I really like it that way. Um, it went from 121.08 to 64.12 grams. My goal is to finish it and it'll be done by next month. So let me put up the game board while I shuffle. I just wanna ensure you I do have the Joker in here and I am going to pull two cards. I always choose from the top. I always choose from the top. Um, and I don't burn a card in the beginning either. So, um, so hopefully you got to take a look at the game board. The first card I am choosing is the King of Spades. The second card I'm choosing is the Five of Diamonds. So, ha! Debbie did not curse me. She, we were getting, we were doing our makeup today together, and she's like, "Since you made fun of me, hopefully." It was a long story, but she totally didn't understand my phone number, which I gave it to her correctly. But it was a really funny story. She ended up writing it down like a social security number or something. We were laughing so hard, but um. So she's like, you, your number is wrong. I'm like, no, it, it, here's the area code. <laughs> it was so funny. Anyway, it had to be there. Um, and she's like, well, since you made fun of me, imagine if you get the Joker. And I'm like, oh, 
I hope I don't. So I didn't. So I got the king of spades and the five of diamonds. Yay! I'll be right back to show you what I chose to put into this project. Okay, so the prompt for the king of spades was newest product. So I chose the product that I wanted to give away. Thanks, Deb. Um, I was so, I only enter giveaways of the things that I really, really want. And when I found out I won this, I was so super excited. But it's the Natasha Denona Diamond and Blush Palette. Look at this gorgeousness. Um, this is starting off at 328.06 grams. My goal is to use each of the products one time. These are the creams, these are the powders, and I really just wanna see what the formula is like and if I like it and all that good stuff. So, you know, I don't wanna make it too big of a goal because I have so many other things that I'm panning. And my goal for this project is to roll in as many prompts as I can to just get use out of as many products as I can. So um, yeah, so that is the first product I'm rolling in. The second product is for the Five of Diamonds and that the prompt was concealer. So I'm putting in this e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. This is in the shade Fair Rose. I'm not even certain that this is the correct color for me, but I would only be using it under my eyes to brighten up. And this is starting off at 32.82. My goal is to only use it three times because I have three other concealers going in projects right now. And again, this is one that I haven't had the best luck with. So I wanna see if it's something that I wanna keep and just trying it three times, I think will give me that knowledge of whether I wanna keep it or declutter it. So I'm gonna wait until it settles. I'm gonna keep it upright and see if I can mark it. Cause when it was laying on its side, it does have like a window and, but that's not really like the proper place where it's at. So yeah, so this is my February update for Deck of Panning. I love this project. Go and give everybody a little love. I'll have all the information in the description box below. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you liked me, please consider subscribing. I hope you have a great day or night wherever you are. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.